hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel welcome to today's video i am going to be showing you step-by-step -step detailed tutorial on how to make nigerian buns this is a very delicious popular nigerian snack and after you watch this video you'll be able to make it yourself at home into my bowl i'm going to be adding three cups of all-purpose flour i had some help with my little ones helping me pour the flour in there and then i went in with half cup of sugar one teaspoon of salt one teaspoon of nutmeg and also a tablespoon of baking powder we're going to give our dry mix a very very good mix now until it is well combined and everything is well incorporated before we add the rest of the ingredients i'm using two tablespoons of good butter you're going to mix that in until it completely combines and you cannot see any butter in the dry mix again okay this is going to take you a while maybe about a minute or two depending on how fast you can mix with your hands you can totally do this with a stand mixer or even a hand mixer if you have one but i love using my hands to mix these things i mean here in nigeria we watched our mothers and grandmothers make these things with their hands so it comes to me naturally if you're coming across my channel for the first time my name is joy eto i am a nigerian food blogger recipe creator and of course a brand influencer so in i added in some milk i'm going to be using a total of one and a half cup of milk and then i also cracked in one eggs but i did not add the entire milk at the same time because i just want to measure out how the dough starts to mix together before i add in some more milk now using a fork i'm going to mix all of this together till the dough begins to come together now bear in mind that you do not need a very hard dough you also do not want a soft runny dough you just want it at the perfect consistency which you're going to see in a bit now while mixing i realized that it still needed some more liquid because right now it is really hard and we're not trying to knead anything here okay so i'm going to go ahead and add in some more milk into this and then just continue mixing you can do well to follow me on instagram where i share recipes on a daily basis and trust me you're going to love it there so i added in some more milk and i'm just going to keep doing this till i get the desired consistency that i really really want okay now you can totally use water for this i mean the commercial ones that are sold outside they use water for it but i prefer the lush taste of milk when it comes to making snacks like this so you can totally use water also if you're not subscribed to my channel do well to hit the subscribe button and be a part of this family once i have this consistency that i am going for i'm going to scoop everything to combine and then just cover with a foil and allow it to rest for at least 10 minutes before i start to fry i'm going to place a pot on the fire and i'm adding about half liter of oil in here yes you need that much oil to fry and to check if your oil is hot enough just put a skewer stick in there and once it begins to bubble at the bottom of the skewer stick know that your oil is hot enough and ready for your dough i oiled my hands with some vegetable oil and i'm going to be scooping and dropping my dough or my butter into my oil okay this drop method really helps to give you the perfect round balls of buns okay drop in your buns into your oil be sure not to overcrowd the oil so that they have enough time to you know float and fry properly continue to turn this is not something that you place in the oil and then you go and chill okay make sure you keep an eye on it turning it from time to time so that every side of your buns is golden brown once the first part is golden brown you take it out you're going to repeat the same process with all of your dough till you're completely out of dough and you know your buns is ready you can enjoy this with any drink of your choice you can have this with juice you can serve this at parties you can serve this you know you can even add it to the lunch box of your kids because kids love it adults love it i love it as well and it is one of those nigerian snacks that we can never get enough of so if you watch this video till this point i'm saying a big thank you make sure to give it a like and a thumbs up let me know in the comment section which other nigerian snack you would love me to film the recipe and post it here for you guys do well to subscribe if you are not subscribed thank you guys so much for watching my video and i'm going to see you all in my next video bye hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel welcome to today's video i am going to be showing you step-by-step -step detailed tutorial on how to make nigerian buns this is a very delicious